Now let's add a watermark. A watermark is a graphic or some lettering that's behind the text and in a lighter um, shade. So we want to go to page layout and here's our watermark. There are some standard ones but we want to go down and choose custom watermark because we're going to choose a graphic, a picture watermark, and then it says select picture. Now you will be doing this, finding these on the shared U drive. I'm doing this at home so I don't have the shared U drive but it will be in the same folder once we get there. So if, if you go into the shared U drive you'll go to Cox Word Processing and I'm going to Word Processing and then you'll find Chapter 4 and the one we want is this Auctioneer. So find the Auctioneer and click Insert and we want the washout and then click OK. So here is our watermark behind our picture. One of the things that is very handy is to look at the formatting. If you'll do Shift and F1, F1 is right next to Escape key, it shows over here on the right side a task pane with all of the formatting that we have added. Um, by looking at the formatting we can easily take out formatting or uh, see what, what is wrong with our formatting.